Uh, Wind-wise along the coast, it's been on and off, but we will continue to see windy conditions through the night. So let's take you through Futurecast and your watches and warnings, and you'll see just that. We've got wind advisories, and we have wind warnings in place through tomorrow morning. So winds continuing overnight into the early morning hours. The high wind warnings in effect for our local mountains. That's where we're seeing some of the windiest spots. Also, the high deserts. This includes the Antelope Valley, the Apple and Lucerne Valleys as well. San Bernardino and Riverside County Mountains, L.A. County Mountains, Ventura County Mountains, all under the warning tonight. And our valleys as well, looking at quite a bit of wind, even the basin affected by that wind advisory. So take a look. By 1130 tonight, we will continue to see the winds whip up across the Southland, especially through our inland valleys and the mountains. Then by 430 in the morning, still windy. And by 930, things are a little calmer, but we will see isolated winds through the Santa Clarita Valley right there and through parts of the Inland Empire, even the coast getting a bit of a breeze by the afternoon and things starting to die down a little more so for us by late evening tomorrow. Temperature-wise tonight, we're quite mild, mostly in the 60s, a few 50s earlier today, 75 in downtown average being 71. So we were above average for this time of year. And you're going to see temperatures tonight falling down to the 50s up to the 70s tomorrow. So still above average, but not as hot as where we were. We are expecting a bit of a warm up as we head into the next few days. So that, more on that in your seven day in just a second. You will see the San Fernando Valley tomorrow in the 70s, the coast in the 60s and the 70s. Orange County also a mix of 60s along the coast, 70s a little further inland. And as we head to the Inland Empire, you're going to see temperatures mostly in the 70s tomorrow, 70 three in Riverside and 70 as we head to Lake Elsinore. So you're going to see your future cast right here showing you high pressure actually rebuilding as we head into the weekend. So that will warm us up. And until then, we do have some windy conditions, at least through early tomorrow morning. We're sandwiched between two pressure systems, and that's what's happening at the moment. We're on the backside of that low, and that's what we're seeing with the wind. So by tomorrow, a little calmer in the wind department by the afternoon, a little warmer by the weekend. And then take a look at what happens Wednesday and Thursday expecting temperatures in the 80s and 90s. You're going to see the same thing for the Inland Empire, the high desert, and for the mountains. Again, temperatures fluctuating a bit, but overall warm and windy through tomorrow. All right, now it's time for our shameless weekend weather plug.